Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, D Wood here, and today I'm gonna be showing you guys my current favorites. These are like my legitimate favorites. I didn't throw no fillers in here. Like this is legit. <laughs> I decided to do this video. Well, number one, it's been on my list of to do's for a minute now. Um, but let me tell y'all what just happened. So I recorded a whole two hour video. How about it's no sound? So I'm hoping that this video comes out right because I'm using the same mic, the same settings, and I think I know what happened, but we're going to see. I'm not going to cry over spilled milk. What's done is done. I'm just going to have to refilm that video. But um, I don't really want this video to be too long, so I want to go ahead and hop right in, show you guys what I've been loving, tell you guys my opinion, and yeah, I want this to just be real cute, real short, real sweet. So let's go ahead and get into it. Before we get into anything though, definitely go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you are not because I be seeing y'all. Y'all not subscribed. Y'all be watching and not subscribing. So go ahead and click that subscribe button. But all right, that's enough talking. Let's go ahead and get into the favorites. All right, so I have one, two, three, four categories. I have skincare, makeup, and body care. I really don't have too many products, um, but I think the group of products that I do have are quality. Um, so let's go ahead and jump into the skincare. I want to start off with my lips. So the first product I've been loving, and I've had this for a hot minute, is the Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme. This is no stranger to the YouTube uh, beauty community. This, I'm pretty sure everybody loves this stuff, but literally, like, it's gone. I'm, like, scraping the side trying to get some more product out but I use this pretty much every time I do my makeup um and I really only use it when I do my makeup because I, I don't like to do it when I'm I don't like to use it when I'm um headed to bed because you know when you sleep you rest your hand and one time I did put this on right before bed and I woke up and there was a huge like mark of um like a not a hive but like this stuff like had plumped up my skin like it, it was like a um like a wet I guess you can say it was like and it just freaked me out so <laughs> I only really use this when I do my makeup now this was an impulse buy and I ended up really really loving it and this is new to my whole little collection it's the elf jelly pop luscious lip mask and you can see I've used quite a bit of it for it to only be about a week old but this stuff is so good now this is what I, I do like to use this when I'm headed to bed um it really does remind me of the Laneige I think that's maybe where they were trying to go you know the Laneige um lip jelly I think they call it girl I don't know the I when it comes to product names I'm a butcher every time like <laughs> The Laneige Lip Balm. Y'all know the sleeping one and the one that comes in the squeezy tube. I think this is where they were trying to go with this. Um, and it also comes with like a little spatula. So I thought that was really, really cute. Um, so I literally slathered this on right before bed. Um, and it smells nice. This is one in a melon. And it, I think, yeah, it does smell like melon. It kind of smells like a little um, strawberry, tropical, starbursty kind of candy. Um, but yeah, this stuff is actually really, really good. And keep this by my bedside. Um, so now I have two skincare products. Um, mainly moisturizers. So first I have the e.l.f. All The Feels Facial Oil. Now I did buy this about a year. No, not even a year ago. This was maybe... Maybe back in September, maybe like late summer, late summer, early fall. Um, and when I first tried it out, I was like, uh, it's okay. But no, this stuff is really, really dope. As you can tell, like it's gone. This was just like a little trial, not a trial, like a little sample. It came in a little kit, but y'all, I have to get the big one because I really, really do like this stuff. It's really, really good. And it says hemp derived, hemp derived cannabis sativa seed oil. I'm not sure the percentages and all that and I really don't care I just know that this stuff is really really good it makes my skin feel calm and very very smooth like that's really the best way I can describe this it doesn't really have a scent it's very very light um and I feel the moisture all day long so 
definitely want to pick this up again and i believe it was very very affordable it's elf so i'm sure it's not that expensive like i said i bought it in like a little set and i think the set may have cost me about 15 dollars um but yeah girl i gotta get the full side of miss all the fields facial oil <laughs> Now, the next product, if you are no stranger to my channel, you have seen me use this in pretty much every video since December. It is the Laneige Waterbank Moisture Cream. Girl, I got a little bit left and, and it smells so good too. It smells very clean, but I really don't even want to use it because I can't find it anywhere. And I just, I don't know, I don't want to run out. I love this stuff so much. This is like my all-time favorite moisturizer. I don't think I've ever used a moisturizer that I loved this much. And I found it on the website at one point. And then when I actually went to go purchase it, I couldn't find it again. I've tried the Laneige website. I've tried Sephora online. I've tried Sephora in store. I've tried multiple Sephoras. And I just can't find it. So, <sighs> Everything that I always love gets discontinued. So I don't know what that's about, but I don't know what I'm going to do. So if you know a dupe for this moisturizer, definitely let me know. Or if you know where to find this, definitely let me know because I need it. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and move into the makeup section. I do have quite a bit of makeup. Um, Yeah, so let's go ahead and jump right in. So I guess I'll start off with a foundation. I've really, really, really been loving the NARS New Caledonia Light Reflecting Foundation. This stuff has been my bae. Do you hear me? Like, when I just want to throw on some makeup really quickly, this is what I'm picking up. I like it because I don't really need much of it, and it really does make my skin look glowy and healthy and plump that's what i'm looking for in a foundation especially an everyday foundation also i think i am a little bit biased because i've always wanted to try a nars foundation and this was my first nars foundation so i think that's why i've been reaching for it so much also the price point like i'm cheap and i bought this with my own money so best believe it's gonna get used so for the oops so for the next product, um, I have three shades. It's the Danessa Myricks Evolution Powder. Um, and I got this in like a little trio. So it came with three different shades, number three, four, and five. Um, five is not really in rotation as much as three and four. Um, but they're like the formula is really, really dope. That's what I'm wearing today underneath my eyes. Like it just looks really, really smooth. Um, but I love these things. Like they're very, very lightweight. It has the slightest bit of coverage, like it has enough to where you can see the color, but it's not overpowering to where if you put it over something, it'll just completely wipe out what's underneath it. It's like a soft, focused, filtered look. That's what I mean by coverage. Like it's not really, I don't know how to describe it. It's just very smooth. It, it kind of just smooths over your pores, over any imperfections, any little wrinkles and stuff. And it just, it looks really, really great on the skin. Out of everything, I highly suggest that you guys pick up these powders. And they come in many different shades. And even if you don't like um, tinted or like, you know, powders that have a little color to it, I think she does a translucent one also. Um, but definitely check these out. Like, I really think... Everybody could benefit from using these. And Danessa Myricks, she got like this whole, I really think Danessa Myricks is like the Charlotte Tilbury for black girls. Like, cause these powders are unmatched. All her products, like the Vision Cover. I'm not even gonna get into all the stuff that I've tried from her, but all her stuff is dope. Um, definitely check out these powders. <laughs> all right, so moving on to some lashes. Um, I've recently been loving, now, I never applied my lashes on, on camera, so y'all know I be using hair glue, um, so I was like, let me pick up an actual eyelash glue because I don't use the hair glue on my clients, so I went and picked up the Super Stronghold 3D Eyelash Adhesive in clear, I don't really like black eyelash glue, that's why I'm really confused as to how I was using black hair glue, but whatever. Um, and this is from the brand I Envy love 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 this stuff dries really quickly and it has a wand on it which is perfect especially if you are a beginner to applying eyelashes i would suggest getting a lash glue that is clear and that has some type of applicator to it instead of something that you have to squeeze out um but this glue is super dope i'm wearing it to hold on my lashes today um 
yeah, definitely gonna be repurchasing that when I run out. Y'all always ask me what lashes am I wearing and nine times out of 10, it's gonna be this brand right here. I get these from my local hair store, beauty supply store, and not the Sally's. I'm talking about the ones that be in like the random little plazas, the little, you know, where the Asians run it. That's where you gotta go. La Flair NY Mink, 100% mink hair. Um, these are a couple of my favorite styles. This is 45. And this is 44. And today I'm actually wearing 49, which is the lash that I go for when I want a little bit more drama. Um, if this lash is doing something weird, just disregard it. I actually took it off because I thought I was going to go to sleep. And I was like, wait, no, I can still record another video. Because like I said, the whole little issue that I had earlier with the mic and the sound, it was a mess. Let's move on. <laughs> Cause y'all know I'm gonna talk y'all little head off. All right, so I have two makeup brushes. I bought these at the same time I got the Danessa Myricks powders. Y'all, this brush really has changed my eyebrow game. Like, look how thin this is. This is the perfect brush to carve out your brows. Or even like, if you wanted to clean up some liner, this is perfect. The top of the brow, the bottom of the brow, like, <laughs> just perfect. It's called the Bold Concealer Brush. It's the number 937 Golden Triangle. I don't know what that means. And this is the brand. I pronounce it as Delium Tools, but who knows? It could be Bedellium. I don't really know, but I say Delium Tools. So the next makeup brush that I have is the Cosette S140 brush. It looks like this. I've always wanted a Cosette brush, but I kind of just didn't want to spend the money on it. Um, love this brush, especially paired with those Danessa Myricks powders. Golden. Like, I love it, literally. This brush is so, so soft. It's perfect for right under the eye. I've even used it to apply my highlighter. Um, it's just, it's an all-around great brush. I also, also... I just had a glitch. <laughs> I also love it to put the powder, whatever powder I'm using, right in my little smile line area. It just fits perfectly, puts enough product on, blends it out real easy, and yeah, love her. These brushes right here, I mean, I definitely get, because normally I just use a whole bunch of Morphe brushes, and yeah, you really get what you pay for, because these are quality brushes, and I mean, they were a bit, not really pricey, but more pricey than Morphe brushes, and I can definitely see why. <laughs> All right, so I have two more products for you guys. Um, one is kind of like bath and body, bed, home. I'm gonna show y'all when we get to that. And then one is body. So um, I've been loving this freaking whipped body butter from a local um, black owned business here in Atlanta, woman owned. Um, the brand is In Style Skin Essentials, and I bought two. So I have this one, which is Blissful Magic, and I have the Vanilla Latte. Y'all, when I tell you, like, it's just so creamy and so buttery. And this is kind of too much. Like, that is way too much, to be honest. I don't know why I just put that much. I, I was really just trying to show y'all the consistency, but... Let me take my ring off. It just, and it melts so easy. Love it. Um, so like I said, I have two of the scents, Blissful Magic and the Vanilla Latte or Latte something. It's, I, I believe it's Vanilla Latte. <sighs> and I just love the way it feels. Really moisturizes my ashy, cracked knuckles, ankles, feet toes all of that knees like it's so good <laughs> so the last product that i have for you um was actually a product that was put in my christmas stocking and i've been loving it ever since it's the bath and body works aromatherapy natural essential oils eucalyptus and lavender essential oil mist y'all can you see how much i've used like it's I don't know if y'all really see it through the little sticker, but it's like this much left. Girl, I be spraying this on me because it says you can use it. Um, It says use as a fragrant body spray, aromatic shower mist, or on your pillows and linens. 
and I definitely use them on my pillows and linens when I make my bed up and um right out the shower give myself a little douse it just smells I don't know how to describe it it's clean and just calming that's the best way I can describe it but I guess that's the whole purpose of it and I don't think oh actually you can see how much I have left right here Every time I make my bed up, I'm spraying my pillows, spraying my sheets, spraying my blankets. And a lot of times when I'm fresh out the shower, I'm just spraying my body down with this. It smells so good. I'm not really good at describing scents. All I know is that this is my jam. So, that's everything I've been loving lately. Like I said, this is a legit, like, these are real. No fillers in here. This is stuff I've been legitimately loving um, but one thing, I think if I could just put one thing at the top of the list, it's going to be this moisturizer. So I really need y'all help to help me find out where I can get this from because I need it. Like, first of all, it smells really good to me. It smells like just clean skincare. Plumps my skin, moisturizes my skin. It's just, girl, I got to have this. I don't think... Like today, I didn't even put no moisturizer on my face because I don't want to use the rest of this. And I could have used my oil, but I'm almost out of that too. <laughs> it's a mess. Um, I really do need to re-up on a lot of these products though. That is all I have for you guys today. Let me know how you like this video and if you want to see more of these type of videos on my channel. Um, I enjoy making this. It's very, um, I feel like we're connecting. Um, but yeah, that's all I have. I'm going to shut up and let y'all go. Alrighty, y'all. I will see y'all in the next one.